and welcome to my channel. My name is T-Man and as you guessed by the title, I'm just doing a quick tutorial of, on how to connect the Tractor Control S2 Mark III with the iPad Pro. So I was trying to look it up myself a few weeks back because I thought I'd try and connect it up uh, rather than using the Tractor app. And then it was just like having problems and I saw loads of people having problems on hooking it up. So I thought I'd do a quick video on the correct order to connect it so let's just get up the other screen so you can see right so there you have it there's my tractor control s2 mark 3 uh, I'm not sure which ones are on the list I checked my one and it was on their uh, mapped list but you can go on the app and it will tell you I think the I think it's 599 a month you have to pay which I don't agree with for DJ algorithm but um, it allows me to get on to Beatport and other streaming ones rather than the Tractor Pro um, app. So, right, let's get over there and I'll show you what's what. Right, sorry about that. I am um, recording everything in the live sort of setup uh, with hotkeys and that. So I don't have to video edit because I don't like it. And I just want to get it done. So first things first, got your controller, you got your iPad. You need a um, charger, which you should have for an iPad anyway. And you got a, all you need is a USB cable. I can't remember if it's B to C, whether it's like a printer cable. It fits in the back there. And the USB is on the other one. So you want that one. I've got it plugged into my power. So I'm going to turn the power off a second and I'm going to unplug that. So, so, so we've got it plugged in, we've got that one plugged in, but we've got no power and that one's not connected. So first things first, right, we want to hold down the flux button, turn on the power to the controller. You've seen it there, it flashed green, that means it went into MIDI mode. Once it's gone into MIDI mode, you can connect your cable, but make sure the app, the DJ algorithm app is not open. So plug in the cable like that, open the app, and it should connect. Voila, voila. But just to be aware, if you're setting this up for the first time, obviously you'll need your RCA outputs um, going into either a set of speakers. So you can get a little set of um, audios for like, like, I got a little set off for like 20 quid off um, second hand, or I got a better set over by my production gear and then what you can do is you can it's all mapped fine so if I go on to there as you can see the buttons are work so you just click on a song click on it And then uh, you can see we have got it set up. So that's how you do it. So I'll just quickly say it again. DJ controller, make sure your power's plugged in but with no power on. Uh, make sure your USB um, camera, or charging cable, sorry, is plugged in. You don't need a USB camera connection kit for that because you can just go straight to it. And then hold the flux button down, turn the power on so the power goes in. It will flash green, sends it into MIDI mode. Then once it's into MIDI mode, you can then plug in your charger cable, make sure the app isn't open yet. Once it's all plugged in, turn the app on and it connects automatically. So there we go, that's how you connect it. So hopefully that helps out anyone. Thank you, goodbye.